Let's build fluency within three. Ready. Here we go. How many dots did you see? Now, I will ask you, how did you see your answer? Did you see one on top and two dots in a horizontal line on the bottom? And you know one plus two equals three? Make this signal if that's how you saw it. Or did you see a diagonal line with two dots and one on the bottom right? And you know two and one give a sum of three. Or, did you see three dots in a triangle? How many dots did you see? How did you see your answer? Did you see two dots in a horizontal line on the left and a dot on the right? And you know that two plus one equals three? Or, did you see a dot on the top and a diagonal line with two dots on the bottom? And you know one plus two equals three? Or, did you see a diagonal line with two dots on the top and a dot on the bottom? And you know that two plus one equals three? Or, did you see three dots in a triangle? How many dots did you see? How did you see your answer? Did you see a dot on top and two dots in a horizontal line on the bottom? And you know one plus two equals three? Or, did you see a diagonal line with two dots on the top and a dot on the bottom? And you know that two plus one equals three? Or, did you see a dot on the right and two dots in a vertical line on the left? And you know one plus two equals three? Or, did you see three in the shape of a triangle? How many dots did you see? How did you see your answer? Did you see a dot on top and a dot on the bottom and a dot in the middle? And you know that one plus one plus one equals three. Or, did you see three dots in a vertical line in the middle of the page? Wonderful job! Today, we made the number 3 in multiple ways. 1 plus 1 plus 1 makes a sum of 3. 2 plus 1, and the turnaround fact of 1 plus 2 also equals 3. We also saw that the shape of a triangle can show 3. Go on to set 4.